So here's my Vertimax 3000 watt pure sine wave inverter. And there's my Renogy 60 amp solar charge controller. All the wires run out of this bin. And run over into the battery bank. The inverter is wired here and here. Right there. The charge controller, the solar charge controller, positive is here. The negative I had going to this terminal here. The Victron battery monitor was not picking up any of the voltage coming in to the battery bank from the solar charger. So I googled it and what I needed to do was take it off of here and I put it onto there. So this is the lug side of the battery monitor and that's the ground side. So the coming into the lug is the negative from the batteries and the negative from the charge controller. Now when I look at my battery monitor batteries are a hundred percent they can run for infinity at the current load and the current power input from the solar the batteries are at 13.8 volts and there's a current discharge of 0.3 amps or 0.1 amps it's constantly fluctuating based on the cloudiness or the sunniness of the sky so it's been running all day overcast sun clouds batteries at 100 percent so this way in the morning when we wake up we will know how much battery life is left um, at night in the colder months when we uh, wake up we realize we don't know we or we didn't know without going out and throwing an amp meter on the batteries where the batteries were in their state of charge so now, when we wake up after running the furnace all night, we'll know if we can turn on a coffee pot or not. Down here is my inverter on-off switch. When I turn on the inverter, it doesn't matter if I'm plugged in or not plugged in because of the th uh, two automatic transfer switches that are installed. The inverter is isolated. And when I turn on the inverter, I do need to turn off the batteries. Otherwise, the power is coming into the rig from the batteries through the inverter, going through the battery charger inside, being sent back out to the batteries to charge them up. Called the death cycle. <laughs> uh, so... Right now, that's the only downfall to our solar. Other than that, everything's working beautifully. We can run everything except for the air conditioner. And I just ordered a, a soft start. Uh, I'm not really sure what it is. Capacitor, perhaps, um, for our air conditioner. So we will be able to run it for a short time on our 
battery bank. We have three 100 amp AGMs. All right, guys. Be well. Talk to you soon.